<laughs> That's Corticia, huh? <laughs> hey, y'all, uh, mic check, mic check. Uh, drop a one in the chat if you can hear me. <laughs> <laughs> Cool, cool, hey cool, everybody, cool. what's up? Oh, I have my mic turned down. Okay, I, I hear. But can you say something? I hear you now. Hello. Hello. Can you hear me now? Hey girl, hey, I can hear you. Girl, fresh off the dentist, baby. You want tea? Let me see. Oh, okay, Kelly <laughs> White. We we'll see you this Friday. <laughs> what up, though? Fresh out the dentist. Look, fresh out the dentist office. I've been trying to listen to y'all be in the dental chair and everything else. Oh, well, we appreciate you. We put your energy. In. There was a lot of comments yesterday saying, I just love Akia's spirit. <laughs> Thank you, girl. It's mixed with a little ratchet and a little country. That's all. And we love it. We love it. We love it. <laughs> but um, I'm excited today. I'm me too. Excited. It's the last part of the virtual vision board party. Part yes, three. Yes, ma'am. That's it. So you, are you ready, Casey? Because we're going to get into finances today. Oh my gosh, I am. Okay, let me pull up my Canva. All right, do you want me to go ahead and share my screen first or you go share yours? I'm a I'm a share for I'm in my office today. Okay. So hopefully okay. the internet connection is better. And if y'all have not started y'all vision boards by now, there is no excuse, y'all. Come on now. We're on day three, part three. You should at least have the, the fulfillment part done. Thank you, Sharika. No excuse. Not necessarily the signage in the back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's so pretty. <laughs> That's it. I'm in the I'm in the office. Yeah, I got that sign on Facebook. Etched on wood. It's pretty. Let's see. I'm sharing my screen. Can you guys see my presentation? Yep. Let's see. Casey, can you guys see it there? Is it still loading? We see it, mama. Oh, I forgot you can't see the comments. Yes, we see it. You're good. I'm, I'm giving you a thumbs up like you can see me. Yes. yes. Okay. You remember we can't see. See, y'all see my Chris White smile and my good wig. I did that for y'all. That's a wig, girl. That's my good wig. Oh, on the computer, on the show. Okay, y'all. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, no, this. Look, you know they put braids and wigs now too, but these, this, these from the scalp. <laughs> All right, today <laughs> is part three. The we are rounding out part three, right? We we're talking about finances. All right, so. What I want you guys to do, because I want to keep in touch with you guys after this, you guys already know who I am. I'm the Brandon Bennett. I'm a veteran. I'm the resume guru, mother of two. I own three businesses. I'm your business bestie, right? Because we're here to do this together. Do me a favor. Everybody here, please follow me so I can follow you back. I would love to keep in touch and do great things together in the future. The vision board does not stop here. I throw them all the time. So I would love for you guys. So if you got a minute, hop on Instagram. It's the Branding Bandit Academy. And if you get on Facebook, I have the Branding Bandit Academy, but I have a private group. So if you see something that says push group, when you get on Facebook, go ahead and join it. And I grew up, Casey. I got a TikTok now. I grew up. Okay, so big dog. I see you. What is it on TikTok? I'm What's your username? It's a Kia Collins on TikTok. I'm gonna be dancing through y'all living rooms real soon. <laughs> real soon. <laughs> All right, so let's get into it. Let's get there. This remember, this is your vision. This is exactly, you know, this is a giving you a you know a mental picture. You can see it on paper, right? I feel like I like pen to paper and I like the digital version of it. You guys know I got it on my screensaver on my phone. Like it's a big deal. And we can make the short or long term, right? We can make, I do four vision boards a year because I'm very goal oriented. So I can knock out a vision board in two to three months and move on to the next one. A vision board is a collage of images and affirmations, and it's going to represent our goals and dreams. Remember, if you don't, if you weren't here for the first two days and you haven't saw the replays, log into Canva, create you an account if you don't have one. 
hop in that search bar, type in mood board, find a template that you feel suits this mission for you and get busy. So our agenda was day one, fulfillment, day two, family, and day three, finances. All right, so remember the rules of engagement. If you weren't here, we're gonna be transparent. We, on this vision board, this is, your, this is your dream. This is your goal. This is your affirmation. So lying and keeping secrets and, you know, kind of being shy about it, it's not going to help you. We want to be credible. So the first stage in being transparent is honoring that we need to be and trust in the fact that we're going to do right by that. We want to stay authentic because we need to stay true to ourselves. And we, the biggest thing about everything we've been doing in this entire conference, right, is building sustainability. And with that, everything that we're doing here is the foundation for us to lay to build another brand in the, in the latter part of life, right? So whether you're doing this for three months from now or from five years from now, let's build sustainability within generational wealth, our family, the people that are coming into our network and for our brand to have a legacy. Because that's the whole finding of sustainability. We're building legacies. So the big topic today is finances. Finances is basically the management of a large amount of money because we are going to touch a lot of money, right? And we're going to do the study of money management, money and investments. We're going to talk about all that today. So the big question, right? Do you have finances in your everyday lifestyle? So remember, we're going to stay positive. We're going to have positive emotions and optimism. We're going to make sure that we look at this in a futuristic view so we can be better, so we can grow and scale. So remember, this is my board. This is encompassing fulfillment, family, and finances for me. This is my vision board that I've been working on for the last few months. And now it's actually time for me to do a new one going into January. So let's go. Katie, you ready? Let me stop sharing my screen. I'm ready, friend. Okay, I'm going to share my screen now. I'm ready, friend. Okay. Okay. Let me pull back over. Yes, Anika, I don't know you, but I'm actually, I'm coming to North Carolina on the 19th. I told Paquita this already, but I'll be there on the 19th. So if y'all want to go get, you know, get mimosas and fall in the bushes, I'm for it. I'm definitely okay. for it. Fall in the bushes. It's the fall in the bushes for me. Girl, because it's going to be daylight, you know. <laughs> we need to see the bushes. All right, I'm ready. All right, I'm going to get in the comments now. All right. You ready? Okay. So we got our fulfillment. We talked about our family. We got a little Maya Angelou, you know, with a mix with a little Harry Tuck. <laughs> yes. Okay. 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 I think you need to switch to LD. Switch it to LD, low definition, it'll probably come through. Like right under your picture, switch to LD. Say something. Can y'all hear her in the chat? I can see the chat. Can y'all hear her in the chat? Let us know. Yeah, they, we can't hear you, Akia. Let me tell y'all something. Y'all don't want me leading this vision board, okay? <laughs> I will if I have to, but yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought you were saying, no, we don't want y'all to do it. Okay. I'm like, oh, who am I going to tattle to? Okay, Akia, we can't hear you, friend. And it, it might have to be, okay, how about you, Akia? Log out, refresh, and come back in. Okay, friend? Okay. Okay, class. So, <clears throat> welcome to Bootleg Vision Board Party on Finances. Lucky for you all, I spent 10 years structuring loans. So, I know a little bit about cash and nothing about vision boards, but we're going to do this together. <clears throat> so, what you see here is my attempt at making a vision board from the first two days. Uh, first day on family and second, first day on fulfillment and second day on family. Now, 
Thank you, King. The King said, I got this. Now we're talking about finances. Akia, come on in the room. And uh, to start, <clears throat> y'all, where is Akia? Okay. <laughs> Brings new meaning to college. <laughs> okay. All right, for real, y'all. Okay. So y'all know I'm good for this. I'm going to pull somebody to the stage. Okay. And I'm going to um, get you to ask me some questions that you think a kid would ask me about finances to put in my vision board. Okay, oh, she's back. See, God is good. We can hear you, friend. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Let me switch back to LD. Michelle said, praise God. Okay, Listen, what about now? Know what <laughs> yes, we can hear very well. <laughs> okay, cool. All right, so let's hop into it. All right, so when you think about finances, right, how do you envision your bank account based off your performance? Is this, a, is this today or in five yeah. years? We're going to start with today and we're going to progress. Okay. Um, I envision my bank account um, today with recurring streams of income. So not, um, not start and stop, which is the case in the beginning of consulting or finding business, but like really recurring um, and very predictable. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. So from five years from now, how does that look? Um, I envision it being very, very diversified. Um, so mixture of long-term retirement funds, um, brokerage accounts, um, assets, a mix of assets, right? Like properties and art and, um, patents, et cetera, et cetera. So just very, very diversified, but heavy. Big banks take little bank energy. Huh. Okay, so here's my next question. Do you have a bail team? Like somebody that can bail me out? Do you know? Okay, so here's the second question. What does the acronym bail mean? B-A-L-E? Or B-A-I-L? B-A-I-L. B-A-I-L. Like bailing you out is the context I know. Like if I'm in a bind. Somebody can get me out, but what's yes. your, is that what's true? Uh huh. Well, what are you talking about, friend? So, because we're talking finance, it's an acronym. We're talking about finance. So, B is for banker. Uh, a is okay. for accountant. Okay. I is for insurance. Okay. L is for lawyer. This is good. So, do you have an account team so you, so you can touch that money? This is really good. So um, banker, I do have a Bank of America business banker. Um, and that's where I used to work. So I just kept them in my business relationship. Mm -hmm. um, accountant, I'm leveraging um, Quicken very, very heavily um, for uh, okay. the automatic automatic like uh, updates of my books and like automatically transferring that into TurboTax, et cetera, et cetera. Now I am, because I want to be more strategic about um, the way I do my taxes um, and really, really thinking smart about everything. I am in the market mm -hmm. for an account that I can build a relationship with and put strategy to it, not just keeping the books clean, but put strategy to it. Um, I is for insurance. Yep. Um, I would say I could do I could do better on the business insurance. Like I could do better with like just in case there are some is some litigation or different things to really insure myself. Um, so I could do better on that part. Mm -hmm. And then legal, I do have um, mm -hmm. a legal package. I pay a subscription 
um, to always have things that I need off the shelves to pay, to have lawyers on demand. Like I just recently did a whole bunch of like about like 10 different trademarks. So I've just been talking to lawyers a lot in November about how I want to structure that stuff. So definitely I, I want to mm -hmm. grow on the A. I want to do better on the I, like really get it there, but B and L, yes. Okay, so definitely put that on there. Bell Team should be an acronym for your finance segment. Okay, say it again. Oh, okay. Bell Team should be an acronym for my we're finance We're going to be bigger. Segment. I love these questions. Yeah, so I don't know if they're going to be on here, right? Akia, Akia. I love these questions, Akia. <laughs> okay, so we can type it out stuff. in text if they don't have something for it. Oh, facts, yeah. facts, facts. facts. Big so, I'm gonna put yeah, bill, so bill, the importance bill, of bill. this, if anybody, if you're hearing what we're saying, yeah, put just don't add, add a heading and we'll just do bail. It's important. And I learned this because I actually recently had to sue someone. So I'm so glad I had all of this in place. And I was taught this at a very, very pivotal time in my business, because when you're spending all this money, you need to kind of know where your money is going, how it's operating. Like the building I'm in right now, I ran an office fleet. I have insurance on myself and I have workers comp in my um, business insurance. So if I come in here, I trip on their stairs, fall and bust my leg, hurt my leg. Right. I'm, I'm good. And while I'm not working, I'm still paid. I have, you know, I paid legal shield for a monthly subscription that when I need something handled, they can write up documents. I have an accounting team that's made of five people and they do all my bookkeeping. They do everything that I need. And then for my banker, um, I have a banker that's assigned to me at Navy Federal. I call them. I tell them what I'm trying to do. And between my banker and my accounting team, which consists of a tax strategist, I'm there where I need to be. Right. So okay. for anybody who was like, you know, what's this? The bell, the bell team is lucrative, especially if you're, you know, if you're charging clients upward of five thousand dollars, you know, per you know situation. It's very lucrative that you have that lawyer to make sure there's no um, shady gray areas. And the coldest part, right? If nobody's ever paid attention, if somebody sues you, right? You want to make sure that your lawyer knows that they need to sue you where you live at not where they live at. That's dope. You don't want to be sued somewhere else. If they take you to litigation in a different state, that doesn't benefit you. So in all my contracts, you have to take me here in Washington County. I don't care if you live in Pluto, you're going to have to come to Washington County and abide by these country laws, right? It's beneficial right. to me. Those little right. verbiage, that little bit of verbiage keeps and goes a long way. And that's why I build team is so pivotal, a pivotal especially because we're going to, we're going to touch a lot of money. We're going to right. touch a lot of money. So this is, this is, this is important. Right. Yeah. Very important. Okay. So we got out the bell team. So we know what we got to work on for 2022. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So boom, we're going to speak into futuristic. We got our bell team. Yeah. How does that change the way you now touch money? Yeah. Um, it changes everything. Like it makes sure that every single thing I do is optimized, right? Like there, that there's heavy ROI, that there's heavy strategic planning, that mm -hmm. there is no fear. I'm, I will always be, I will always be ethical, right? But if I know I have my bail team on my back, then I'm not, right. I don't have anxiety around, right? Like hiccups that might come along the way. Like I know. Yeah, just like medical insurance or any other type of insurance, car insurance, I know I'm covered. Right. Oh, yeah. Said bail so team. now that we've established, because oh. we. That's it. OK, so now we're talking about money, how it's going to talk. How does this change? How will this change how you move in the future? Um, The bail team? Yes. How could this change? How could this enhance your business in your future? Um, it'll just be five, five, right? Like I don't, I don't have to know everything about everything. My bell team fills my gaps. So just much like you're doing right now around the idea of having a bell team, right? So 
it changes everything. Like right. everything that I would have done by myself, it magnifies at least tenfold because I have a bell team. Oh, do I need to do like a like a yeah. something getting big? Yeah, big come on. We come build on. inspiration. Come on. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna I'm gonna say swell, multiple multiply. I think about this too much. Y'all tell me what to do. Multiply, okay. that's it. That's it. Okay, that's it. Okay, so let's see. So let's see. It could be a collect. You can use something that's collaborative because now we're building collaboration. That's true too. Oh, is this kind of it, Nancy? This is it a little bit, y'all. I don't care what y'all thinking, y'all said. My vision board is cute. Okay. It's yours. We're not here to tell you nothing different. It's yours. I feel good about this. I see hearts. Okay, y'all backing me up because the the chat's getting kind of quiet. Like, what's she doing? Okay, I'm good. I'm good. We in it. We in it. I and hope they're doing their vision boards too. They not because they judging my they judging my vision board. Girl, <laughs> you're so funny. We, I promise. See, they even said that Sharika said we are not, but okay, I can't say that part, Sharika. I'm, I'm trying here. See, but we are. <laughs> I got another computer. I see it. <laughs> Thank you, Keisha. That's why Keisha top three. That's why Keisha top three now because she rock with me. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> okay, so guess what? We're building a foundation now, right? Yes, we got fulfillment. Yeah. We got mm -hmm. family. We talking finances. How does the finances now help you buy that nanny that you was talking about you need? Because remember, you said your mama was going to raise your kids and your mama said, no, she finna go out and hang out. So now oh, you can God. afford that nanny to go on them trips. Basha, it, it changes everything. Sis. I love this ex exercise. It changes mm -hmm. everything because all I got to do is point. All I had to do was point and deploy resources to it, resources to it, and it's done. And mama, you want to come over here for three months to Africa? Come through, sis. I can have a home over here, a home over there in the States. I can I already. Now I will say, I believe today, I already believe today, Akia, in investing in help. Like, yes, the, 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 the she's not a nanny, but somebody come through and clean up for me. I got people, yeah, I got people, but the more money. Not no I'm thinking too Let much. Me, it's, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, you're thinking just right. This is what this is supposed to do. This is a think tank. This is a brain dump. Because guess what? Guess what finance did for me this year? It allowed me to have a weekly housekeeper because chasing two kids, yep. commuting back and forth to school, running yep. errands, yep. running three companies, doing vision yep. boards, yep. coaching clients, yep. getting on live. Yep. I'm going to tell y'all right now, there was a time I was depressed going in my house because everything wasn't put up, right? Well, guess what? Yeah. We got a housekeeper now because we made them finances click and cleared that bank right. account. Right. It so changes that's everything. what finances can do for you because it's long, it gives you longevity. Yeah. yeah. And more capacity, right? Like this lady, I love her. Uh, Shouts out to you. Uh, sis, I won't say your name in front of the world, but yeah, like she washes my clothes, she cleans up the house, like she puts stuff in the yep. closet and organizes my drawers, like all of that stuff. Um, and I don't have to think about it. And my boo cooks everything. Yep. Um, I haven't cooked probably since February. Yeah, it's really she does awesome. it for see, change it, change it, even change if you guys think about it. It changes your energy level when you get home. To come yeah. home to a clean home, you got your you got your nanny or your housekeeper, you got your bell team making sure your money good. Now you're fulfilled because everything is rolling. Your family okay. good, your family happy. We making okay. money. Like you okay. see how this all rolls in this vision board. Yeah. See what I'm saying? That's why this vision board is important. That's why I do so many because it's this is easy stuff to tackle. Right. Especially if you if you're organizing it properly, right? Yep. And then, you know, if you really think about it, 
Think about how we were taught in family. Let's go back to family. We were always taught we had to clean, cook, take care of our spouse, take care of our kids, do homework, go to all the games, do this, do that. Well, now we're the breadwinners. We don't have that opportunity. But if we get out of our own way and work towards the point of outsourcing help. Say that, sis. The finances will, the finances will take care of the family. And now we're off the of field. I love this. And I love being so vulnerable in front of all of you guys. It's uncomfortable. But at the same time, I'm like, this is healthy for me. Um, so, yes, I just want to share that as well. OK, what next, friend? Okay, so how much money, what what figure are we going to touch? Billions. Put it. Big Put B. It there. Big I need to see billions on your board. Yes. yes. I'm going to have, I'm, no, for That's real, it. for real, I'm going to have, I'm gonna have financial institutions, like, for real, for real. Okay, well, I need to see a financial, a financial institution in billions. Put it in the atmosphere, put it on your board. Okay, because I'm definitely going to do that. I'm going to start a fund, and it's going to be for Black women. And I'm going to angel invest. I'm going to loan, lend. I'm going to do microfinance loans in Africa. Let's do this one. That's right. Let me put it over here by me. <laughs> why, why is my vision board <laughs> not cute like yours, Akia? First of all, it took a cup of wine to get that cute because Campbell be stressing me. <laughs> the rose, you right. You be stressing me, man. Yep, tell her, Nina, speak it into existence. I'm going to put a bunch of these. I'm going to put, make it rain. Can I put rain dollars? I'm raining sure, on the coast. It's your vision board. You okay. Put whatever you Okay, and it's gonna be make it rain, my girl. Make it rain. Kind of on my arm. You like I was hitting my arm yep. like that. Okay, I'm good. Paquita, I'm see. I'm not a corny person. That's why it's not corny. I, I'm I'm life. <laughs> I'm a vibe. <laughs> you are a vibe. Baby. You are. I'm a vibe, baby. I I really thrive That's on that okay. in the sense of I want. I, this needs to be enjoyable. There's no point in making this stressful. It needs to be enjoyable. Remember, we talked about transparency, being authentic, and this is making sustainability for us. Yeah. Because now we can really, yep. you're thinking about like, damn, I can really do this. Like this is, these yep. are my dreams. I, I'll ask yep. you guys this in the, for you guys answer this in the chat. How often do you dream about your legacy and what you're going to be? Casey, how often do you dream? All the time. All the time. Every single day. Like, like a kid, like, do you know, like, Blaze was just named in May of this year, but I believe that much in us. I believe that much in the power. Like, it hasn't even been seven months yet. Like, I just started this company in January. <laughs> like, like, I believe that all of these things can happen, and I believe it does not have to take three lifetimes or two or one, to be quite honest. Um, so all the time, sis, I dream of it all the time, and I'm going after it for us, for me and for us. Right. So, Nina, you know the cool thing about dreams, right? We have to scale our dreams and pick one at a time so we can actually touch them all. Nina said she can't keep up with the dreams. Girl, we're we going to keep up with them. We're just not going to let them run laps around us so they can be obtainable. That's right. We're going to get it. We're going to get it. I'm not on your toes. I love you dearly. But my biggest problem was I wanted to touch everything, right? I had to touch it. If I don't touch it, I'm going to lose my mind. But when I scale my dreams back and I put time constraints on when they can actually start, right? I could have a dream today, but I'm not going to start it for like a year or two because I need to scale it. I need to define it. I need to map it out. I need to even make sure that my mind can handle the capacity in which it's going to go. So that's why this vision board does this for me. I have my brain moves at a thousand miles per hour. And it's not good. 
it's not good because it can be dangerous if you don't put your dreams out on paper. You got to put them out. You got to map them out. You, you have to look at this vision board and say, oh, my God, this is obtainable. Let me give everything on this vision board time constraints. Because remember, all dreams don't have to be completed. Some dreams are merely dreams. And sometimes we're supposed to take our dreams and give them to somebody else. Because what? Sometimes, you know, a, a, a good idea for us can be a, a dream come true for somebody else. If we just, what, what does it say? Let me hold your hand. Yeah. That's the theme, right? We, yeah. You know, that's another thing with the vision board. Yeah. Like, you have to remember to put people in your vision board because the, the dream is how many people can you touch? How many that's can you real. affect positive change in within that's your right. vision? That's what the vision board is. So remember, we've talked so much about self, but really the baseline of this is how many people can you positively affect with your vision? So how many hands can you hold throughout the transition of you fulfilling and deal, you know, diving deep into your vision board? That's why I like it, because the baseline is really your legacy, what you're going to do. That's shame. So that's how I feel about it. That, you know, in case you've already done that, right? So now we're in finances still. The Blade, we're going to say in five years, the Blaze Conference has exploded, right? Like our atomic bomb, yep. Hiroshima, right? Yeah. We've been around the world. We've bought houses. We've gotten married. We got yep. kids. Oh, we got so mom cool. living like the Bryans yeah. did. You know, we got, yeah, yeah. We got mom and them living right. What is next? We're five years. What is Blaze? What? How can Blaze? If this keeps going, right? Beyond what and we're doing wheel. here today. Yep. Exactly. That's it. So, what does the finance aspect of Blaze look like? Do we hire teams? Do we outsource right. different people that we've met through? The, do we outsource the people that are here from Blaze? Of course. Yeah. Like how does you know what I'm saying? Like, how do we take this and we keep we keep yeah. building the network? Yeah, of course. Like uh and that's starting in 2022. So right now, now we gotta like, see Yeah, Blaze will have chapters and cities around the nation. And uh that's already happening in 2022. Um but it will be a global thing because the diaspora is around the globe and we all have similar stories. We were all snatched from somewhere and put in other places and are all trying to get a piece of somebody's pie until we realize we can create our own. So yeah, like Blaze will be stood up around the world. Um, and yes, we will outsource. Yes, we will have teams. We will intentionally pour into communities that are otherwise marginalized, we'll source uh from those communities as well um mm -hmm. we're going to be i really want to deepen in five years deepen my impact in africa quite honestly because all of the riches are coming from africa but no no manufacturing plants are over here they, they're everywhere else and then they sell stuff back to africa they sell their own goods back to them refined um so yeah i want to bust through that and like really man all of that man like it's infrastructure it's scale is it's the same way i'm taking borders off with this right here i want to do that around the world and the, and the money is going to make that possible and the money is going to employ people around the world the money is going to uh pay for education for people around the world the money is going to be you know turning into loans for people around the world okay so what word would that fulfill on our vision board or a picture, maybe a picture, community, maybe, mm. network, community. Um, man, it's the man. Um, y'all help me in the chat. It's kind of like Africa for me. It's kind of like diaspora. Um, what will the money do? I think break chains. Let's see if I can find a chain being broken. Okay. 
Oh, these are so corny. Lord help us. Who 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 is responsible for curating this? So that lady bleak. who made five point two million dollars off Canva. That lady. <laughs> what is this lady doing? Right, that lady. I'm sorry. I I'm can't. Gonna tell I'm, you. I'm, I'm What's up? Girl. Sharika, guess what? You get to take your time and enhance your your um your board. Cause you get to go back in there, do backdrops. Trust me. I have to one day when you I'm gonna drop all mine on Instagram one day. I'm, I'm gonna put a post up and I'm gonna drop all my vision boards on a link. I think so much about this, sis. I, I have no idea. Y'all give me a word. Sharika said my board looks good. Bond, community. It do. Okay, we got bond. We got community. We have. Community feel too small. Like it's a network. nation. Oh, here we go. Blaze Nation stand up. <laughs> Shondo, where is the organ? I'm like, it's a Cheetah. Where is the hand in Oregon? This is so. There you go. Get you a map. Okay, I guess. It ain't enough, but okay. <laughs> we'll do this. I already kind of got the globe, but that's fine. All right, here we go. Sharika said my um vision board looks good, y'all. I just want to repeat that for the people in the back. Okay, there we go. Girl, you are too funny. <laughs> you and this vision board. Okay. okay. So we're we're like in that we're we're like we're rounding out. Okay. Yeah. So we've talked, we, we, we're working on fulfillment. Mm -hmm. We have talked about what it's going to do for our family. Mm -hmm. We have talked about our finances. So mm -hmm. when you're looking at all of this, how do you now feel? I feel, you know, I feel like this is powerful because I'm literally seeing the things that always swarm in my mind and in my heart and in my gut. I'm seeing it visualized. And to be quite honest, like it all looks achievable in five years. Like it feels even more attainable than it did when it was swirling in my head. Like I feel like um, right. this is a a depiction of my plan, if that makes sense. Okay. So what word describes your current feeling? Uh, um. I'm gonna take it from the chat. A cape, a cape describes my current feeling. Okay. Big girl energy. <laughs> Big girl energy. Nep said that. Oh, you said that. I thought Nep said in the chat. Somebody, uh, somebody wrote that I can't see it though. I'm going kind of slow, but probably this is energy. Oh, I got to sneeze, y'all. Sorry. <laughs> Energy. Bless okay, you. I'm very picky, but I'm just going to choose a cape. She's kind of sexy. I don't have this hair, but okay. It'll do. But yeah, this, yeah, I like <laughs> it. You said her hair. <laughs> yeah, I don't have to see it. That ain't, that ain't my ministry, but I like it a lot. Let me change your colors. <clears throat> I'm colors. I like it a lot though. <laughs> okay. All right. So let's round it up so we can do some QA. So this is the last word. So okay. I'm gonna give you your word for 2022. Are you ready? Okay. Yes. The word for, for everybody for the rest of the year, the vision board word is consistency. Ashe. Consistency. We're going to be intentional with providing consistency. Ashe. So, yes, our word for 2022, consistency, okay? So, we need to put consistency somewhere in here because that's going to be your word. Yes, ma'am. Let me find a cute color. Let me do some effects. This word deserves some effects, okay? Okay. Yeah, we need some, we need to be seen. But consistency. Chapel, what? Y'all, I think it's kind of cute. I'm going to have to take a step back to make sure I really think it's cute. But let me find a different color. 
Child, why see, this past problem? year, the vision board was, we did intentional for 2021. We will be intentional with putting our brand out for the world. So we've done that, right? right. Now we have to consistently right. keep it there. Oh, and then let me tell you something about what my creative self just did. Well, I put the word consistency on the glow, Akia, which is the five-year goal. See, I'm going somewhere with this, somebody, huh? And with consistency on the glow, <laughs> that means I can attain that thing. Okay, that's all I got. All right, friend. <laughs> all right. Okay. Girl, I don't know how to get no shadow. Hey, Cortese, you Girl, that, I don't know. I don't know how to do that, friend. Oh, you want me to do like this, like that, like this? You want me to do like this? <laughs> uh, that's that's it right there. Okay, you want me to stop sharing? I oh, said that one. I'm glad you approved branding architect. Ah, okay, y'all, I'm gonna stop sharing my screen. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> that was amazing, friend. I'm glad you liked it. I'm glad you liked it. See, remember when we first talked this out, you were like, well, I guess I can do it. You know, you're yeah. like, I I'll do it. You were nervous. You were, you were, you were so nervous. Yeah, and because we're like, that I was so vulnerable, right? Just so everybody knows, whoever was here on the first day, y'all already know this because you experienced the the circus. But this was not planned for Casey to share her 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 vision board, answer these questions. So this was very very raw. Okay, um, all three days were very very raw. First, the kid was gonna share hers, you know, and eloquently talk about bail and all of these things. But you know, honestly, a kid, uh, just to give you your flowers, like. I appreciate you um, putting me on the spot and having me to answer these questions because as nervous as I was and as honest as I was, like I think it's healthy for people to see that we are all human. Like, like a lot of times when we're looking at Instagram and we see somebody, we're like, man, like I wish I was, you know, but like, nah, like we all just figuring it out and do the best we can. And a lot of times we don't know what the hell going on. We're just doing our best, right? And this vision, right. well, I don't know what the hell was going on, right? But like, it still fed me. It still poured into me. It still gave me something. You just show up. Okay. Anyway, what questions <laughs> do y'all have for Akia? What y'all got? Drop them in the Q&A. We have six minutes left. Um, and let me tell y'all something. Yeah, I it, listen. So what's coming next is five five, okay? But we got six minutes here. So drop some questions in the Q and A or some comments, even right. Um, I can share it on the screen. But what do you have? What are your reflections? What are your thoughts? What are your questions? Can we get deets on her signage? It's beautiful. Yeah, so they want deets on your signage. That's who did my signage. My signage. Edged on wood, so you guys can see the whole thing. Oh. Etched on wood for those who are mm -hmm. watching on Facebook, lurking in Twitter and Twitch and Vimeo and YouTube. <laughs> on wood. I'm so sad because I couldn't get this to share on my personal page. I I signed in, but it's only showing on my um my business page. So I've been sharing it, you know, so everybody can see what we're doing. Dope, dope, dope. Yes. Oh, there's a question so, in the in the box, two questions. Um, first one is from Cortesia. Once you make the vision board, once you make the vision board, what's next? Great question. So, uh -oh. so if you were when you jump into the branding bandit academy, right? When you join in the push group, basically for 2022, we're gonna stack the deck. So stacking the deck, the acronym will be using the word deck. So boom, we just designed it, which is designing the vision board. We're gonna execute it right we're going to start making movements towards that then we're going to come back and we're going to calibrate right because sometimes we got to come back and fix some stuff even though we see it a certain way we got to fix it and then when, when we do those three steps right we're going to kill it and we're going to step so we're going to stack the deck so that is the new foundation. That's what we're doing for 2022. It's going to come. I'm giving it to you guys first, right? But we're going to stack the deck. So D is design, which we just did. Yep. Yeah, so we just designed it. We're going to start execution. 
after we execute, if we see it doesn't work the way we want it to work, we're going to calibrate, right? Because a little calibration, it never hurts. Sometimes we got to go back and rebalance and refocus. Come on now. We feel like we got, got our things together. We're going to kill it. I say. I love that. Next, I see. I'm, I'm just looking at the chat. <laughs> Y'all are funny. I'm deep in my shana. Okay, next question is from Nefertiri. She said, I appreciate the, deep, the three day time span. Is this typical or was the time adjusted for the purpose of the summit? So it was actually created for the summit. So you guys, I wanted you guys to really touch it. So but the way I run my vision board on Facebook is a little different. I pick um, eight entrepreneurs and we sit down and we have a two hour discussion. You get 10 minutes to discuss your board and we have three topics and four pillars that they're based off of. And I give you the ability to freestyle and talk to people and be vulnerable, just like we're doing here. But now that I've kind of yeah. done it, yeah, we do it in a two hour span. But now that I wanted to test the three day method with you guys, and I really like the foundational piece of it. So it's probably going to go to three days now. And I'm probably going to start running it this way. Um, Anika and Crystal asked, I display my vision boards. I put them on my stories. Um, I put them in posts on Facebook. If you guys weren't here yesterday, hold on. I actually put mine on my cell phone. So I, I can see it every, every day. I love every that. Single day. I gotta I see it. That. I gotta believe it. I'm a visionary. Yeah, I'm a visionary. So I'm always on the go. So this needs to go with me. <laughs> I'm gonna be so motivated after putting it on my screensaver. Like, since you are on to something, I'm so serious. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be so girl looking at the globe and the cave and the girl, what? And yeah, it kind of it kind of sucks. It doesn't all fit on your phone, but the you can shift it right to what you want to see. I'm gonna resize so, it. I'm gonna resize yeah. it to landscape, kind of. Yeah. And then lastly, yeah. Akia, before we go, I want to share that someone gave you your flowers, Nina. She said, Akia, thank, thank you. you so much for taking this idea of vision board to more than a vision board. That's right. Your framework expands what I think about vision. It's more than pictures and a fancy font and fancy fonts. It's the meaning behind it. I say. Thank you for operating in your gifts, sis. Thank yeah. you. Y'all gonna make me cry in here. Oh, thank you. Yeah, um, I love this. Beautiful. So, Akia is five five. We've enjoyed her for three days, and believe it or not, Akia is coming at us tomorrow with a TED talk. So we're not done with her. Uh, her TED talk is "We Are Pressure." Do not miss it. But up next, we have. Cartesia, y'all let me tell y'all something. This girl, I love her. Yeah, I love her. I love how real she is. Uh, I love her. <laughs> so please show up to her workshop that's coming up next on Let's Go Viral. Have your pens and your paper out. And FYI for housekeeping, just know that um, after we watch her workshop, you're going to have to go back into another session for the q and It's some tech stuff that makes it that way. But we're going to watch her workshop and then just come back in for another session for her Q&A. All right, I'll see y'all on the other side. Thank you so much, Akia. You're so dope. You're so, so dope. Uh, we appreciate you. I will see y'all some Cortesia. I've been getting on her nerves. She's been my vent session for the last couple of days, so I can't wait. <laughs> Love it. All right, y'all. Bye. See you later. <laughs>